I've installed a program called Visor that I'm trying to use to uh, actually play my my phone on my PC. Of course, I, I just had to go through and disable all my notifications to keep them from popping up, but I think I got them all now, so we can, we can uh, start working on this. So what we want to do here is um, go through the, the current update, uh, play, uh, do the um, uh, do the paralog, um, play through, uh, sorry, do some summoning. I'm interested in trying to see if I can pull off a, uh, I, I kind of want a Henry, Henriette, wow! Two reds and two greens in, on this banner. That is, that's actually a pretty bad banner. <laughs> that's a really bad banner. I mean, I guess I guess we gotta deal with what we got, but that just that's just kind of a sucky banner. <laughs> okay, um, yeah. So first off, I, I have not actually done any of these quests yet, so maybe we'll do some quests too. What do we need to do to get those? All right. Well, um, no, this is just like a freaking banner. Oh, then, uh, I mean, maybe we'll go go for, I think we'll go for, uh, uh Shinnin. So let's, let's try for Shinnin. I'm not gonna, like, do a full pull or anything. I'm just gonna pull a couple. Wow. I got a silk. Okay. That was kind of random. I'm more thinking of Shin because I, I'm interested in trying to get Deadeye. Okay, uh, he has pull red. I'm just gonna pull one here because there's, there's only one red. I got her! Cool. Okay, so, uh. I don't know where our full stats are, but th these are our base stats. Looks like she's got a low speed. Okay. All right. So we got Henriette here now. Okay, here it is. Interact with the eyes, my summoner. So we've got our uh, our summoner here, Kieran, which I'm gonna change to. It's weird because the, 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 why is it always crap? What happened there? Oh, I see. That's better. All right. Realm, uh, let's find a, uh, a cool design for you. Let's see. I like this one. Um, what should we? Do? I don't know. I don't know if I ever. Really... Nah, I don't like. I think that fits this, this this design. Well. It's one I like 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 to put up though, so let's just do that. Copy skills. Like what what options do we have here? Okay, th th this is kind of a, th this program's kind of doesn't have the best quality. Dire Braille Bay Bilk. Oh, it's specials. Keep keep put specials up too. Fourteen. So those like just 35, 35, 20, 28. See if we've got like a uh, life that four could be neat. Alternatively, we've got a 
uh, Death Blow 4. I think I want like a uh, solo. So Spiral 3 could be could work well. Come on, where are ya? Brave second speed, not bad. Brave second speed four too. Nah, that's a bond. I want a solo. Here we go. No wait. I don't have a four. Oh, interesting. I mean, in that case, I think I'd rather, rather go with uh, Swiss Barrel 3. That's fine. Oh. <laughs> you can even change the weapon? Stone and... Oh, okay. Stone, L Stone, Atlas. So these are... Then these are... Looks like they're spe special lower level, wep level weapons for... Uh, Summoner. Reposition's always good. You don't need to worry about um stats here, so you want want to find something that's useful. So I think reposition's probably a good, a good option here. Probably not an Aether. What does this do? Uh, grants attack speed, defense, res, plus 4 to allies within 2 spaces during combat. Inflicts attack speed, defense, res, minus 4 on folks within 2 spaces during combat. Okay. Um, I'm not sure how, how like, what like, will we go well with that. Just a pretty basic idea. Maybe ruptured sky or a blue flame. Let's do ruptured sky. I really want you, you can't use Wrath King because it's it's ranged. Sudden pack might be a bad idea. That's a question too. If, if you do, if you don't have the character anymore, do you lose the ability on summoner? I wonder how that would works. Link skills might 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 be a bad idea, but. Uh, Ooh. Special triggers during, before or during combat. Grant special column my, my, minus two after combat. That would basically give you a, another round right away. That's pretty good, I think. Now after this null seed disrupt, prevents units counter attacks during combat. Well, we'll go with that for now. And lastly, a, a decent C skill.
joint hone. Oh wait, the other one's a joint drive. Heck, I'll take that. Oh uh, wait, I didn't change the secret seal yet. Okay, let's let's find a something like a Swiss sparrow. Okay. Blindfold. Okay. Oh, the quality is awful. Oh, it's a joke in the fact that so you don't see his so you don't see his see uh, Summer's face. I get it. What do I want here? Something something that that's. You mean earring? Hmm. Oh, I might like that. I wish I could change the hair color more properly. But that I like the, um, the the ponytail on on, uh, on that, that fits realm that fits realm. I wish I, I wish I could, you know, there was like a at least an option to, to shift the hair color, but I guess they don't want to have to you know deal with that. So there that's my summoner. Oh, here's a Henriette. Okay. So what are these quests that we're looking at? Okay, arena duel quests. We could do some arena duel this week. Uh, well, I'll arena duel right now. And we also got the just defeat foes for. Okay, I'm looking for the um the tickets. Where are those? Aether raids. Oh, here we go. Clear with the foul maps and the Tempest Trials. Weapon Refinery. So we have Joshua. Let's take a look at him. Joshua, uh, his default is... Accelerate Special Code on Trigger, Coma Count Minus 1, and Res Plus 5. So this uh, this base effect has remained the same. But if foe in, he also gets, if foe initiates combat or foe's HP equals 100% at the start of combat, Grants attack, speed, defense, res plus four to you during combat, and inflict special call on charge minus one. On foe per, per attack during combat. So this is if the foe initiates combat, uh, or the foe's HP is 100% at the start of combat. So if he initiates and the foe is 100%, or if the foe initiates all the time, uh, he gets plus four to all stats. It's not bad, but it's, it still doesn't seem like it's Something that's that great. It, it won't really help Joshua become a, a good vile unit. It just won't. Um, but Reinhardt, I heard something has been interesting. Uh, this is, of course, Sword Reinhardt, not not base Reinhardt. Base Reinhardt would, would be base Reinhardt st still pretty good as is, I think. But he would be completely and totally. Uh, <laughs> if they gave him refine, he'd be just completely busted. He's already he was already busted to begin with, and he hasn't yet gotten a. Um, uh, he, Reinhardt has not yet gotten a. Um, what do you, what do you call it? A, I don't know what they're called, but he hasn't he hasn't got gotten an upgrade yet. It's it's through the. Uh, Resplendent heroes. He's not got a Resplendent version yet, so of course. Uh, once he, if he does get that, which I'm sure he will, base rank will, uh, that that will greatly improve him. And, and you know he's already, he's already busted as is. He might not need a refine, but I think they'll eventually give him one. It just, it's just fine because they, they've been avoiding giving Reinhardt one so far. And unfortunately, it also means that Owen hasn't gotten refined yet either. Okay, uh, so he's got at start of combat, if foe's HP is greater than fifty percent, grants attack plus five to unit, and inflicts attack minus five on foe during combat. And also, if unit initiates combat, foe cannot make a follow-up attack. So, if uh, Reinhardt initiates combat, 
and the the foe, the, the, I mean, he's got he's at bad speed. So of course, if any foes he attacks are more than likely they're gonna be they're faster than him, but they will not be able to attack twice against him if if he initiates combat. Uh, if foe's HP is greater than fifty percent, he gets attack plus five, and the foe deals five less damage. That's also that also balances out, so Reinhardt takes less damage overall. Oh, it's possible. Okay, never mind. I, I'm pretty sure that um, these these are separate conditions. So the, the first first condition, foe's HP is greater than fifty percent. That affects the first two things. Uh, he gets attack plus five, and the foe gets attack minus five. But he also has a separate condition if you initiate combat. So if he initiates combat, the foe can't make a forward attack. Uh, but that's only if if the foe initiates combat. Not not not. And that's only if he initiates combat against the foe. If the foe needs to come against him, then that doesn't happen. That's a pretty good ability overall. I do not have Nina, so I can't show her off. But I can show off Nino. Nino. Her base effect is speed plus three. If unit speed is greater than full speed, deals damage equals seventy percent of damage speed stats. This is uh, a lot different. So her base effect has been updated. Grant speed plus three, deals twenty percent damage of units speed. So what, the, what does that mean? Well, for one thing, there's no limit cap. Okay, her original one was if unit speed is greater than foe speed, deals damage equals seventy percent of different speed stats. Now it's just a straight twenty percent of her speed. Period. So what, what would that be? Uh, let's try and figure this out. Um, okay. So, her, my, my Neo speed is 47. So, my Neo alone will deal additional, so every hit that she deals, she'll deal an additional, uh, I think this is a true damage too, she'll deal true damage of about 9 per hit, which is already, with my Neo alone, that's already higher than what her, her original effect was, because her original effect was different speed stats and a max of 7. On top of that, she grants attack speed plus 4 to allies in 2 spaces during combat. If she's within 2 spaces of an ally, sh she gets attack speed plus 4. So that's that's another thing she gets. Now, the other thing too is, does this deal... I think this is just her, her visible speed. So you might want to um, work... If, if you want to improve her even more, you probably want to boost her speed even more. Because um, right now, I, I'm doing about 9. Let's see what would happen if I... If I Okay, Nina's refined. Exactly special trigger cooldown minus one. If it against flying foes, if foes defense is greater equal to foes res plus five, deals plus seven damage. If you is within three spaces of two allies and a support partner pair, grants attack speed, defense, res plus six to you. Wow! With three spaces of two allies and a support part. Okay. Dang. So, that's plus six to all stats. That that seems like it's complicated to set up, but that's way more than what you'd usually get for these kind of things. So usually it's it's plus four to all stats. Okay, that that is pretty cool. But um, this one for Nino, I really like as well. I'm definitely gonna get this for her. I have just enough. I do use Nino on a, a decent regular basis. Okay. All right, so one more thing too. Uh, we want to look at a couple other things because we've got, uh, from what I've heard, something like these are straight up new skills that that your legendary, legendary heroes got. So, uh, where is he? We have Ike. Here he is. Okay. There we go. So apparently, Ike just got a straight up new skill. Rain Aether 2. So, his original Rain Aether, during combat, treats foes' defense res as it, as it reduced by 50%. Restores HP equals 50% of damage dealt. I think that, um... Is is it an upgrade? Uh, the original Aether is 5, so I think this is a, this wasn't a slight upgrade, but it's basically, it's largely the same effect. It just, um... It has a, a, a uh, shorter cooldown, but, but his new one is going to be interesting. At start of turn 1... 
Grant special column minus two to unit, so that cuts it in half. Treats foes defense and rise as reduced by 50% during combat. Restores HP equals 80% of damage dealt, so it looks like it's the same effect. It just, on turn one, it cuts it in half. Alright, so that is his uh, new ability there, but he also has another new ability, and th these are just straight up new abilities they got. If you've already got them, they, they just keep it, and then, um, uh, yeah, th there, there's no condition on anything, you don't have to uh, get them again. If you already got them, they, they get these abilities automatically. You can probably even, you can probably even um, uh, follow them off from too. I have not originally. I think I had him sing with uh, defense tactic. That's why I have him on. So his new one is joint drive res. Grants res plus four to add in two spaces during combat. If you use the two spaces of an ally, grants res plus four to you during combat. So yeah, I mean, pretty basic stuff. But I, I mean, this might be a lot better than his original because his res is kind of weak. Um, but he's got. Warring Breath, which helps him out a lot. That helps balance it out. And one more we have... Fjorm, who also got an upgrade. She has now Ice Mirror 2. So her original effect was, if foe is 2 space from unit, reduces damage from foe's attacks by 30%. Boost units next, bo boosts units next attack by total damage reduced. By any source, including other skills, when special triggers. Resets at end of combat. So it basically just reduces damage to full attack by 30%, and then she boosts her next attack by, by total damage to reduce, which is not that great. Now this one, reduces damage attack from full attack by 40%, so it upgrades by 10%. She gets an additional 10% off of uh, damage damage received. After triggering, boosts damage to units next attack by 40% of units res. So th it still has a new effect, but this time it increases her damage by based on her a percentage of her res. Very similar to how Nino got uh, up to her percentage, which per uh, gives her a straight percentage of her uh, speed instead. So these are some pr pretty good abilities that they got here. And again, if you have them already, they're completely free, and you should have both both an Ike and Fjorm if you did not follow them off before. Oh, okay. So she already had attack and defense bond three. Now they just give her attack defense bond unity as an extra. Yeah, I had put like fury on her. If you use it in two spaces of an ally, grants attack defense plus five and bonus to attack defense during combat equals current penalty in each of those stats times two. If you use my seven penalty to attack, it grants attack plus nineteen for net bonus attack plus twelve. Oh, it's to, it's to the current unit. So if she's got penalty, then this will it will negate it and give her an additional. Yeah, okay. It multiplies it by two. Okay, so for first she has attack attack defense plus five, so it's plus five by default, and then um. Yeah, and then her her penalty. She's got penalty of like say seven. She gets fourteen. Uh, on top of uh, that, and, and, addition, and then she also has the additional five, so it goes up to a total of 19 technically because uh, the base effect was already attacked with defense plus five. So yeah, these are uh, all, again, these are completely available for free. That's a really nice update, and they're gonna keep doing this for new future legendary heroes too. Uh, most of the older ones, but yeah, that, that's the thing there. They've updated Mueller's Strike now, but I don't know if it's available yet. Summer. Vile summary. Of, oh wow! Dang! Your shield's train has changed. Okay, here we go. N now it's the expanded map. And your summer's right here. Can you place a new one, or no? Is it just? Hang on. Defense team. Oh, okay. You cannot add one here. What? I 
I probably should have to my, 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 my defensive team, but I just, I haven't really cared that much. I just come in here, do it, and then I, then, then I just, whatever. I don't care about it that much, so I haven't really done anything, but I wonder if uh, what this is supposed to do is... No, but it doesn't change it, so what... How do you uh, do this then? Is it just a straight up extra slot? Alright, well, let's try and find something here. Um, who do I want to add in? Assuming I can. Yeah, okay, so it. Huh. It's marked as it's marked as a, cro a X. I'm not sure what the point of that is. Okay, so it doesn't look like this does anything here. I think what I want to do is I want to put in. I sh really should switch my, my, my roster out a little bit. Let's do a fly knee now. Fly Pegasus. Sure. Makaya maybe. So those are not doesn't look like they're they're available normally. Defensive team, yeah. They're still they're still X'd out. I don't know what that means. The summer is solo, regardless of, of, of what goes on. So the, the summer is always uh standalone. I think I like Huh, so you, you can still move them around though. I don't, I don't get that one. Well, all these deals 20 damage to foes within f five rows and five columns there on, on my summoner. Okay. That's interesting. Okay, so we can't actually do this right now, but I just wanted to take a look at that.